Welcome guys, Crypto Lights here, we're back again with another video. And I just want to start by thanking the Bobble Network community for helping us get on Blockfolio. It's good to have a strong community pushing, making the right referrals and the right suggestions to the right places. You can actually download the app and uh, check out Bobble Network on Blockfolio if you are a Blockfolio user. Alright guys, so I do appreciate that. Um, another thing I wanted to mention is if you're not using Dex Tools, uh, that's probably one of the main places you want to go to find Bubble Network. And also, we are on Chartex.pro. Um, if you're not signed up for a paid service on Dex Tools, this will be lagging by like a couple of minutes. All right, so it won't give you accurate price action um, unless you are paying for it. But if you go onto Chartex, it does lag a little bit as well. But it's still a little bit more accurate than it is on Dex Tools. Um, so that's definitely a good place for you to go. Um, do your chart, enjoy your lines, do whatever you need to do on there. All right, guys. Um, but one thing I also wanted to bring to your attention is that uh, just like any good project coming out, you're always going to get scammers. So we've got Bubble Network here, which is the correct one. We've also got a few uh, scam addresses over here. Click on that, you'll see there's no liquidity. Um, looks like people have been robbed from some of these already. Um, it's always a shame to have things like this, but um, it's always going to happen. Uh, we make it very clear right at the top of the website that this is the contract address. So go to the source if you do want to correct the contract address, copy that into Uniswap, and please do not use any other address than this when you're looking for Bubble Network on Uniswap. Okay, please make sure you're not putting your money into fake scammy tokens the people are thieves and they're a disgrace all right take it as a warning from me there are scammers out there trying to uh, take advantage of bubble investors potential bubble investors so yeah thanks again to the guys that got us on blockfolio i also want to address one thing um we paid a youtuber to do a video on bubble network okay now at first glance it looked like they had a lot of subscribers, 136,000 subscribers. Okay, the videos were averaging about 30,000 views per video. Now, I didn't find that YouTuber myself. I basically just approved the spend, all right? Um, and I did actually check out the channel, you know, just very quickly. I looked at the comments, I looked at all, everything kind of looked good on the service. It turns out that, you know, that uh, channel could potentially be like just using a lot of bots and stuff like that. All right, so it might be a bit of a wasted investment, but um, these things do happen, you know. Um, we can only learn from it, come back stronger. All right, but we do have the AMA next week with Crypto Wendy. All right, and there's also a few other things in the works that we are kind of spacing out to kind of you know time those correctly. All right, guys, but just keep your eyes on the market, keep your eyes peeled, um, stay in the Telegram group, make sure you get your information from there. All right, guys, and hopefully we'll have some good news for you guys in the coming weeks. Just to follow up as well, CoinGecko application did go in. All right, they have responded to us. There are some further checks that they need to do. Um, Coin market cap has also been applied for, and that went in today actually. And so we are waiting to, you know, get get approval on that as well. Hopefully, we'll be some good news in the next coming days and weeks. All right, guys. So that's all the updates on Bubble Network at the moment but we will try to keep everything in tune with the roadmap also. Go and check that out on the website. Ethereum does look like it is trying to uh, put in a little bit of a reversal. That would be a nice way to end this week. All right, let's just uh, lower the time frame. Uh, you see there is trying to move to the upside, but it could just come up to this level and just get rejected. All right, but it would be nice to see this continue on a trajectory that it's on. If we go on the one day chart, you can see it is having that kind of curve, that curve pattern that I like to see. All right, um, so this could potentially be, you know, just getting ready to head up further after a pullback. All right, obviously we know that Bitcoin pullback and everything else pulled back along with it. So um, hopefully we can get some more upside from Ethereum. That would be good for the rest of the altcoins. Talking about those curves, we did talk about on Bidal just the other day that um, this was putting in like a curve bowl shape trajectory as well. Okay, and obviously got a little pullback after that video, um, a couple of hours later after that, but it did kind of find its support and continue to the upside as it is currently. All right, guys, so Bidal does look like it's trying to at least 
put in a little bit of a trend reversal pattern um, we had this big shoot up here okay now it didn't put in a higher high but what it did put in was a higher low all right and now this move hasn't finished yet but if that can put in a higher high and then put in a higher low and take out this level over here i would say that this will potentially be looking at confirmed trend reversal off the back of that um, not until it puts in a higher high and then another higher low and then begin to make some uh, movement to the upside as well now just to wrap up the video i wanted to talk quickly about wise token because i did do a video about it the other day and i wanted to do a quick update on my recent findings with it all right i have been doing some research watching videos by the founder stuff like that having a look into the tokenomics and the whole model now i will put a referral link actually so you can actually use my referral link to buy wise okay and that will get you 10 percent and that will also get me 10% um, or it will earn me 10% referring interest paid only after one year though. Okay, so if $100,000 was referred, I would earn $10,000. If a million dollars was referred, I would earn $100,000. It's quite a good system actually. And that's why you'll find a lot of YouTubers are pushing it and pushing it and pushing wise in terms of referral i'm not knocking that that's you know i'm doing the same thing now i'm giving you a referral link but you know if you are going to buy it you might as well use your referral link because at least you get a 10 percent and whoever's referring you will get 10 percent and we're all supporting each other i was thinking to put uh, just a little bit more into wise token and when i say a little bit actually maybe i should say a lot more because looking about you know anywhere between 10 and 30 ethereum um, because I do actually like what I'm seeing, I like what I'm finding. It actually reminds me of the reasons why I decided to start my own cryptocurrency. All right, there's not a lot of trust out there. There's not a lot of uh, good projects. There's, there's a lot of rug pulls, right? And um, people fluff it up with all of this utility and use case and all that sort of stuff. All right, a lot of times, you know, you're just going to buy the token for, for price appreciation, right? A lot of these products with utility, do they really have utility? And that's the question because a lot of us at the, at the front end we don't really see or understand what's going on with it um, and that's another conversation but with this um, we can at least understand um, what he's trying to do he's trying to create a trustless um, you, you don't need to trust the founder Peter all right although he does seem like quite a trustworthy guy and he's very convincing it's written into the smart contract so it took them about a year to create it they burnt the admin keys, so you can't go in and change any of the information. Everything is automated by smart contract, by way of smart contract. And it was actually audited and completed um, to, you know, the highest standard whereby, you know, what I'm looking at in terms of documentation. So yeah, that's definitely interesting. Um, you, when you stake, um, you cannot uh, withdraw your stake until after 365 days. Um, so you get 3% interest on your staking. But like I said, uh, with the referral bonus thing, people are actually earning a lot more in referring interest paid after one year, okay? Because you're getting 10% as opposed to the 3% you get on staking, all right? So um, now you'll know why a lot of YouTubers are kind of really pushing this and getting you to use their referral links. But you can actually self-refer yourself. So just create two wallets, right? Once you create your first wallet, you can, uh, let's just go to uh, the main page and see where the referral link is. So if you go to the main page, you scroll down, it basically generates a referral link for you. You can copy your referral link, go into your other wallet and then just paste it and kind of buy your tokens from there. And then, you know, you'll be able to earn your 10% um, from yourself and then earn 10% for buying as well. Um, and the founder is well aware of that. He does actually address it and he encourages people to do that. All right? He's not really bothered about that happening. Okay. And it doesn't need to be changed. So that is definitely something that's good. They also aim to put 90% of uh, Ethereum raised into liquidity straight into Uniswap. All right. And right now, you can see there's over 23,000 Ethereum raised, which is probably over around 13, 14 million dollars, which will automatically, well, well, 90% of it at least, will automatically go into liquidity. Now he says it's probably probably going to be something more like 99% of liquidity, and there's no team tokens, and the only way for the team to acquire tokens is to buy tokens. All right. So they're talking about making it fair, all right, guys. And um, not only that, 
it's, it's basically uh, just self creating its own market value so after the pre-sale ends which will be on the 31st of December right if we go you can see um, it actually ends and you can claim it was on the 31st of December that's when everything will probably kick off and um, obviously I, I think that this is going to get off to a good start initially just like any good decent project will especially when you're adding a lot of liquidity into the market that's also going to affect um, uh, price action in a good way right and um, people are going to FOMO uh, or especially people that miss out on the pre-sale and all that sort of stuff but um, there's no rug pull right so as more buyers come into the market which will be an attractive marketplace with so much liquidity there's also a protection against dumping for the simple fact that there is so much liquidity so when there's so much liquidity in there if someone's up 5, 10x or something and they sell, right, because there's so much liquidity in there, that's going to be more like a stability kind of mechanism that's going to stop the market from completely dumping on your head. It's going to be very hard to drain all of that liquidity, all right, so um, that's definitely a good thing. Now, uh, in my previous video, I actually um, spent one Ethereum, uh, well, I didn't spend it in that video. But I used, uh, I showed you guys that I had used uh, one Ethereum. In fact, let's just uh, let's just go to my uh, dashboard and show you guys because I actually put another Ethereum in um, for my own reasons. Now I need to go to my dashboard. Uh, let's have a look. Alright, uh, why is dashboard? Okay, so I put one Ethereum in the other day. Alright. And from that one Ethereum, I was a little bit disappointed because I only got around 4,300 wise by the time it ended. Okay, now I have put in another Ethereum. Okay, in fact, I put 1.26 Ethereum in last time on the fixed amount. This time, I put another one Ethereum in, I got 10% uh, of that as well um, from referral. Basically, it ends in a couple of hours about. 10 11 it ends in three hours if we go back to the dashboard um, or the reservation sorry this is the pool that i got into which ends in two hours and 51 minutes now i decided to go with this pool this time because it was ending soon and because it's only got nine well at the time it had 900 and something users now it's got 930 users all right as opposed to this one this has got a thousand users and the downside to it is that it could be anywhere between four million wise and six million wise however you know that's not something that bothers me too much because it's not like this one where it's like either one wise or 10 million wise okay and i mean i haven't done the calculation but if you look at this one where it closes in another day and two hours and 50 minutes right and that's already got a thousand users okay so um how much is that going to increase by tomorrow you know that's another million wise uh, you know that could be like uh, all that wise has got to be you know spread out over all of those people as opposed to even if there was only four million wise spread out over the you know total amount of users in this by the time it ends in the next three hours you still might end up with more than what you would in this one for the simple fact that these users still have another 24 hours to kind of increase and increase right so there's a logic behind that you know it might not be the best strategy but um I am testing out different methods. Um, if I do get a decent amount from this next pool, you know what I'll do is um, potentially kind of spread out um, between 10 and 20, maybe even a little bit more. Maybe I will, I will probably go up to about 30 Ethereum. I would spread that out between the uh, fixed supply pools. Okay, so um, you know maybe one, 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 one 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 okay and probably do that and go over until i've spent about 30 ethereum maybe um and just do that uh, so it might end up with you know if there's 10 10 pools i'll probably have about three ethereum in each pool and that's just in theory you know i'm not necessarily i might not spend that much all right guys but um i just might because i do like the model and i'm thinking it might be a no-brainer to just get into it and probably hold that for a year i mean it's better than it just sitting there doing nothing right so um, yeah, it's always wise, I guess, wise to invest your money um, in, the, in the best places, all right? This does stand out as probably one of the most um, trustworthy 
um, kind of sure thing investment right now. All right, this could definitely be a beneficiary of the bull run um, when it does go live in December. Uh, so going into January throughout next year, um, it could definitely be a good investment um, in my opinion. Yeah, I think that's about it guys. Um, yeah, I just wanted to update you on that because I do definitely feel um, it's definitely got some legs. So yeah, I think that's about it for now. All right guys, make sure you are careful and you're not buying fake versions of Bubble Network, okay? Look at that, that's terrible. All right guys, go and get the contract address from the website, all right? Um, all the links will be in the description for all the social medias, all right, and everything like that. You can also become a Patreon and that gives you access to my private Telegram group, okay? Don't be a stranger and I'll see you guys in the next video.